14 people, 8 days, 8 nationalities, 21 kilometers, 7.7 kilometers per hour. In our city is taking place the workshop where the international group of people is working on communication skills related to outdoor activities. Our guest is a leader of the project, Serena. Serena, what is the purpose of the project? The purpose of the project is to bring together people uh, with different backgrounds, with different experience from different countries and to provide a context in which they can share experience and also to provide some uh, experiences of outdoor activities uh, where they can live like these very special moments and then put it together and build some uh, radio shows where they can communicate these experiences to the others. But the here is Maria. Here. Yeah, here. <gasps> Fourth day at the project is almost completed. We met uh, Reynolds. Hi Reynolds, how are you? Fine, how are you? <laughs> I'm fine, thanks. Uh, can you tell us what was the main goal for today? For me, the main goal for today was to climb on the wall, on the real wall, uh, wall to in the first in my life because uh, before I did it on the inside, on the walls inside, but never in the real uh, rock wall so that was the main main goal for me okay uh, so which of communication competencies was the most useful for you T today most useful competencies for me was uh, sometimes to don't speak at all and then uh, and listen to, to others okay thank you very much Reynolds <laughs> John, John, are you there? Do you hear me? Yes, I hear you. Hello. John, uh, thankfully I hear you. Uh, tell us what is the situation down there. It's pretty cold and wet here, but competitors don't give up. They cross 5 kilometers of the cave and on the lead there is a champion from Belgium, Stephanie. On the second place there is a Bartosz from Poland. They are pretty close to waterfall and now the question is, should they use rope or jump into the unknown water? Uh, thanks John for the report. Mm -hmm. This is almost everything from Garina. In addition, we have a final conclusion of the project. During last few days we spent amazing time with all participants. Evelina. Which competencies participants develop the most in your opinion? I think that active listening, helping each other and building trust. You are completely right. What's about you? What have you noticed? In my opinion, they were working on uh, motivating each other, uh, staying calm during crisis situations and providing valuable feedback. If you want to find out more about the project and all participants, we encourage you to visit our site on Facebook, which is Experiment Radio. Thank you for your attention.